All right, everyone. I am uh, updating my recent uh, DNA stuff, and I was going to read the article called Two Year Sentence Given for Failure to Provide. This is a common running theme in the family, I guess. Not on my dad's side, but uh, other people within this line. So I'm looking for my father's parents. And Foss is a common surname in this particular line. So I'll read you the article. It says, because he failed to keep his promise to pay for support of his five-year-old daughter, Henry W. Foss, Stockton Painter will spend two years in county jail, the extreme penalty on the failure to provide charge. The sentence was handed out today by Superior Judge Fred V. Wood, to whom the promise was made on February 7th when Foss pled guilty of the charge. He preferred that his estranged wife, Miss Rose Foss, at 11003 Channing Way in Berkeley, Foss was released when he made his promise to pay, but when the first payment fell due, he gave his wife $5 and induced her to sign a receipt for the full $30. This he returned over to attorney Leo Sullivan as evidence that he was keeping his promise. The same thing occurred the following month. Finally, Mrs. Foss went to Judge Wood and told him of her husband's action. A bench warrant was issued for Foss, who failed into court to explain today. You broke your promise and trifled with this court, didn't you? Demanded Judge Wood as Foss sought to explain. The man admitted the indictment and was sentenced. Fox, Foss was a principal in a love nest raid here last December when Miss Foss led police to an apartment house where he and Miss Hazel Templeton, Stockton divorcee, were registered as man and wife. Wow.